so today we did something you would not do with kids, right? Right. Right. So we had a like seven hour layover. And so we, we left our bags at the airport and we jumped on a train and here we are somewhere in Paris trying to make it to the Eiffel Tower and wherever else we're trying to. It's trying. It's, it's working well. Neither of us have cellular data, but uh, it's freezing cold. It's all right, we'll figure it out. Found it. Oh, there's a tree in the way. Cold is an understatement. It's freezing. An understatement. This is like ski resort cold. <laughs> Look, there it is. There it is. It's right we there. We found it. It's right there. Now the next adventure. Coffee, crepes, maybe catacombs and a ride back to the airport. Of course, Dallas is buying. I have powers. Yeah, I think so. Alright, adventure part three. We tried to go to the catacombs, they're closed on Mondays. And then we tried to make it to Notre Dame. And also still closed for construction. Still a good adventure, but now we're just gonna find a bathroom for Dallas. <laughs> and go back Mercedes. That's right, and go back to the airport. Probably perfect timing though. Yep. There it is. Nailed it. Alright, we made it to the airport, at least. Now we gotta get our bags, get through security, and get back. We are through security. We have two hours to spare. Amazing. Most of the time in Europe, they don't give you your gate until 30 minutes of your flight, more or less, or an hour maybe. So we will sit and hang out and wait for our gate, but we did it. What a day. So we made it to my flat, finally, after a long day of travel. You know, we, we left the airport to, sure, go see a couple of sites, but honestly, to keep us from sleeping. Because if we would have slept at the airport, which we would have, would have happened over seven hours, we would have been so exhausted. We would have never, we would never acclimate, we would never get used to the time zone and we would just be wide awake in the middle of the night, exhausted during the day, and that's not beneficial. So honestly, one of the main reasons we went out was to not sleep and spend less money because airport food, airport coffee, much more expensive than being out in the city. So we got a little advantage that we got to go have some fun and stay awake so that we could get here, walk around the flat, look at everything, make sure everything's okay, get the keys, and we're good to go. So. It feels weird having our own flat. It feels weird actually having the keys and being kind of ready to go. The, the mood changes, the reality sets in a little more, but cool things are happening. Cool things. Glad you guys are a part of it. See you.